We are looking at a function block diagram for a foundation field bus PID loop. We have an analog input block, PID block, analog output block. In this particular case, the input and the PID are both being executed inside the transmitter, and the output block is being ex executed inside the control valve. What I want to do is show you something about the foundation field bus block mode. Every single block in the system, not just the PID control, but every single block has the ability to go into different modes. Now we're all accustomed to the concept of a PID block being an an, uh, auto mode versus manual mode, but it's something to get used to with field buses that every single block here can actually go into different modes, including the input and the output by themselves. So if I go to the analog input block, I'll notice here one of my parameters here says mode, and right now it's in, it says auto, auto. That's the normal mode, and that's the target mode as well. I can force this if I want to into manual mode here, and we'll see what happens. In manual mode, you'll notice this will change to manual. In manual mode, now I get to establish the output value of that block. So I can go right here to the output parameter, and I can say I want that to be a positive 10. And we can see here in the display, that signal now turns to a value of 10. I've put the entire block now into a manual mode where it has frozen the output value at 10 no matter what's actually physically measured. Again, we're used to seeing something like this when it comes to PID, setting the output of a PID block to whatever value we want it to be. However, in field bus, you have the freedom to do that with any block you look at. So switching this back, the uh, analog input block, I can go here back to automatic mode. Or I can also go to out of service. Out of service is typically the mode we want to place the block into if we're going to do some calibration on the transmitter. So if I switch to out of service, you can see here the red X appears. And the output here has a status now of bad out of service. So now what I can do, I can set that value to whoever I want, but it's flagged as being bad. It's flagged as being, hey, we, we, this is not something to be trusted because I'm now taking this transmitter and I'm going to actually do some calibration or other work on it. So that's a, an idea with a field bus. It's kind of new, the concept that you can take any one of these blocks and force it into a particular mode.